Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. What are we on? Wednesday? We're on Wednesday. It is going to be another gorgeous, sunny, 85 degree temperature day. And I am thrilled. Thrilled. Got a little more sleep last night. Struggled to wake up this morning, but I got a couple cups of coffee in me. Now we're ready to go. We're ready to go. Um, I'm going to do, uh, again, as usual, I don't know what this vlog's going to look like. I don't know if we're going to finish it today, if we're going to finish it tomorrow. I don't know. We just go with the flow. That's what we do around here. We just go with the flow. So, I'm going to do a quick outfit of the day. Show you what I packed for lunch. We're going to get out the door. Because that's the excitement in my life. And I'm fine with that. Do you guys love not having excitement? <laughs> like when I come to work on Mondays, Dr. B will be like, how was your weekend, Amy? And I'm like, nothing exciting. And he's like, that's how we like it. And I'm like, yes, that's how we like it. We don't need any... We don't need any of that. We just, we like it smooth and uneventful. Uh, speaking of, we are planning on, go, planning on going to the Tulsa Flea Market Saturday morning. Shane's like, the Tulsa Flea Market's open, are you going with me? And I'm like, 7.30 on a Saturday, cup of coffee in hand. Hopefully it'll be gorgeous weather and we're gonna go run the streets. But anyway, okay, I'm sitting here talking like I got a whole bunch of time. Which, I got I got about 10 minutes, but I won't keep you for 10 minutes, probably. Okay, outfit of the day. First of all, we're going to highlight our Kendra Scott earrings that my cousin Amy, y'all know Amy? She gave me a set. So, they came with a necklace, but I don't have the necklace on. Um, and she had these, and she doesn't really wear gold. She's a silver girl, and she's like... She had them in her jewelry collection, and she's like, I bet, I bet Amy would wear these. So she gave them to me. She gave me her Kendra Scott set, um, and they're gorgeous. Aren't they pretty? I didn't put any second and third holes in today. Oh, they're just simple and classy, and well, you can throw them on with anything. Now, my top, my tank top is from Goodwill. My pants are from Walmart. My flip-flops. You heard me. You heard me right. Um, my flip-flops are from uh, probably Walmart. I was thinking Old Navy, but I think these are from Walmart. And I have on my sweet little Be Still bracelet from Miss Tracy B. Isn't that precious? She made one for me and one for Kimberly when we lost Mom. Um, and then a couple more stack bracelets. Bit bit. And uh, that's all the jewelry I'm rocking today, you know, my silicone ring. So let me back up and show you the fit. This is what I paired together. Kind of a... Uh, let's see, what do they call it on Pinterest? Women 50 and over coastal, over 50 coastal is the category this would fit into. Are y'all on Pinterest? I love Pinterest. You can take TikTok, take that, I don't need it. I like Pinterest. I've been a Pinterest junkie for ever. Anyway, massive inspiration. When I wanna cook something and I don't know what to cook or I wanna find something to wear and I don't know what to do, I just get on Pinterest. Oh, and I want to show you guys. So, this little tank top I got. It's a loft. You know, the loft, my favorite brand. Um, this uh, Goodwill top. So, what I did, first of all, I cut the strings out of this because I don't like drawstring. This right here, so instead of tying it, because it just kind of hangs down, right? And it, it makes me look wide and baggy, and we don't want that. And I work too hard. This is a little hair elastic and I just made a little knot with a hair tie and I used a clear one so you can't see 
and easy peasy, mac and cheesy. Okay, so with all that being said, um, we are not seeing patients today. We don't have clinic today, so I'm just in the office, just answering the phone and doing admin stuff. But we don't want to just, you know, I mean, I could roll up into work like this, but. And when it gets super hot outside, I will be. But this morning, we're gonna put on a little denim shirt that also came from Goodwill. It is, it's Old Navy. I don't have my glasses on. Does that say Old Navy? I think so. Old Navy is small. So we found this at Goodwill. I think Shane found this one for me. Shane finds a lot of my clothes. He's like, baby, here, here, here. And I'm like, okay, okay. It is a blessing to be married to a man who likes to shop. A and who will shop for you or with you or see something that you might like and he'll grab it. Love it. Love to shop. Loves to shop cheap. We like to thrift. Okay, so this is how it looks with the denim shirt on, right? So you don't feel so naked. Okay. Just adds to the 50 plus coastal vibe. If you're on Pinterest, Gotta have your glasses too, okay? Anywho, if you're on Pinterest, um, just search it if you're interested. You may not be interested, everybody's style is different. Uh, but just in the search bar, type in over 50 coastal, what to wear. Something like that. 50 over 50 coastal outfits and it's a lot of denim whites khakis breezy flowy i just love i'm like pin pin save the pin save the pin save the pin and so i tried to pull that vibe off today which i think i did pretty good tried to pull that vibe off today with what i already have in my closet but that's going to be my jam this summer that's going to be it okay um, that's what we're wearing. Let's go see what we got in our lunch. You're going to love it. Okay, this is what we got going for lunch. We got a cup of cottage cheese. The rest of the cherry tomatoes I had left over. Two bananas that are ripe and ready. I like my bananas spotty, spotty, because they're sweeter. I like them ripe. Shane likes them still green. Gross. I like them like this. Um, two organic gala apples and an avocado. This will be my food for today. And I've got protein bars in my drawer, um, crackers if I want them, but we're eating mostly out of the garden. And uh, I love eating like this because, especially in the spring and summer, because the food, you know, it's everything's getting in season and ripe, so it tastes better, it's more affordable. I just feel so good when I put good food in my body. So we are gonna, Pack this up and put it in our little packy pack. This is Riley's. I've got a spoon, a knife, and a fork in there. Chop my finger off, oh, please. Oh my God, the struggle's real when you're trying to film with one hand. That knife over here, out of my way, okay. And we don't want that, make sure that lid is on. We don't want that thumping. Okay, and our cherry tomatoes. So what I do is I mix the cherry tomatoes and the cottage cheese together when I'm ready to eat it. Okay, okay. bananas. I love this lunch pail. It's Riley's, but we share. She'll take mine, I'll take hers. Apples, avocados. Okay, good for your body. Oh, that apple has a spot. That's all right, we'll cut it off. Those apples are so good. All right, I gotta go now. We're gonna fill up our emotional support water bottle and go to work. Hello. Y'all, I had to get outside, you already know. I'm in the neighborhood across the street from my neighborhood. Somebody's building a house. We'll have to come by in a few weeks and see how far they got. We've seen a lot of houses come up together, haven't we? Well, a lot meaning two or three. Anyway, I'm kind of up on a hill and I want to show you the view. Let's get, let's get over here. 
get the orange porta potty out of the way. Let's see if we can zoom in. No, it's not as pretty as it was up on top of the hill. Howdy! <laughs> um, I think it's prettier today than it was, what was it, yesterday? Absolutely gorgeous out here. So, I'm just out enjoying it. <clears throat> I'm not going to, I'm not going to keep y'all out here, but. Um, this is where we're at in our day. We had a pretty slow day at work and I needed to move my body. I did a little bit of weights in the kitchen while I was cooking the dog's food and boiling eggs for um, a chef salad tonight. And so I only got about 15 minutes worth of a weight workout and it was just little five pound weights. So I might do a little bit more of that later. Um, but anyway, this is where we're at and it's absolutely gorgeous outside. Shane's chopping up our chef salad. Big bowl of lettuce, cucumber, tomato, boiled eggs that I boiled up with my little bold. Timu, bold, bold eggs. My little Timu egg timer, purple onion, ham. Woo! We're about to eat a big old fat salad. And I finished off my electrolytes. And I, I did a little over four miles. And now I need to eat and take a shower. Okay, that's a wrap. I know this was a pretty uneventful vlog, but that was my day. That was my day. So I am up here in bed. Shane's downstairs watching TV and laying on the couch. So I think I'm going to catch up on a little YouTube, do a little reading. I am still reading. I think I left my purse downstairs, which means I got to get back up. I gotta go get my purse. Anyway, I'm still reading Trejo. I'm about halfway done. Great read. But kind of like David Goggins, lots of potty mouth. Lots of potty mouth. Just real life. He tells some stories that are twisted. I mean, the things that this man has experienced, but he, he has been in recovery forever he knows Jesus now and but his stories are unreal his stories are unreal so if you can handle some vulgarity and some cuss words I highly suggest it's a great read and you know it's his life it's his life it is what it is and he has come out on the other side and we love a great we love a great redemption story right we love it okay i'm gonna go get my purse because i gotta have my purse it's got my books in it and my nighttime medicine and i don't know i gotta get up okay i love you the lord loves you more and we will see you in the next video